Tonight, Pfizer says its new antiviral pill used with the low-dose HIV drug and taken within three days of COVID symptoms reduced the risk of hospitalization or death by 89% in high-risk adults. It will save millions and millions of lives. Pfizer CEO says the results, which have not been peer-reviewed yet, will be submitted to the FDA for emergency use authorization, likely before Thanksgiving. The very high efficacy comes even to us as a surprise. Meanwhile, as COVID cases soar in Europe, Britain has become the first country to approve another antiviral pill developed by Merck. An FDA advisory panel will consider that treatment for the U.S. later this month. Yay, Yay. Still, public health experts stress that vaccines remain the best protection against the virus. Seven-year-old Theodore just got his. What is this going to mean for you? What's it, gonna mean? It, it means that I can, I can just like have more sleepovers and play dates, and I, and I can feel more better going to big giant. But not everyone's celebrating after the Biden administration announced companies with 100 or more employees would have to ensure they're vaccinated by January 4th or tested weekly. At least 27 states now say they filed or plan to join lawsuits challenging the rule. The federal government can't just unilaterally impose medical policy under the guise of workplace regulation. As for that COVID pill, Pfizer says it has about 50 million treatments at the ready. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.